Hi guys, it's Libby here. Welcome to this new series that I'm doing now, Empties with Libby. I saved all of my products that I've used up to the last drop, cut one of them in half to scoop the rest of the product out. For the past six months, I think, this is a lot. Today's Empties with Libby is gonna focus on skincare and oils and serums. The first thing that I finished quite a while ago, but I've kept for you guys, is this 100% pure uh, multivitamin PM serum. Highly recommend this product. I went through two bottles of this. I used it every single night. It just worked for my skin. My skin is super sensitive. I have rosacea and sometimes my skin like even peels off if my rosacea flares up a lot. But this just worked for me. It's non-toxic, it is vegan, it is cruelty-free, gluten-free, um, and I love this brand in general. They're one of like the OG brands in the game for non-toxic green beauty and they also have makeup which is great but Love this product, will be purchasing it again. Next, I'm gonna put them right here. When I finished with that, instead of buying another one, I actually went ahead and tried this product that I was gifted. It's another serum. It's a vitamin C serum from Ursa Major or U-R-S-A Major. Um, it's with rose hip and aspen. Uh, I have my other vitamin C serum that I use in the morning, but why not use it day and night? Because you just want to brighten up that face, you know? I loved this serum. It was gentle enough for my face. The brand, again, is really great. Um, they are non-toxic, natural, cruelty-free, uh, and yeah. I actually found out about this brand from the store in Boston called Full Lane. I'll link them down below too. Um, they're a great store for all things non-toxic and green beauty and skincare. Hi, Brian. <laughs> Next product is an oil, literally finished, <sighs> empty as AF. <laughs> um, it's from Pi. Pi skincare. They are based in Europe or the UK, I believe, and you know the standards for beauty products and skincare products are way better than here in America. They rule out so many more ingredients um, that are not allowed to be used in our products. I also have their mask, which is amazing. I'll show you guys that once I finish it. I used this at night after my serum, so I would put my serum on, and then my moisturizer, and then my oil. So this was kind of the last step to retain all that moisture throughout the night. And sometimes when my flares for the rosacea was really bad, I would actually also use this before my makeup for extra moisture so that my, like, concealer or foundation or just makeup wouldn't crack and it was great under makeup too so let's do another oil another oil that I loved was it's been so long sitting for this video that there's like steam inside this is from vapor beauty it's essence restorative night treatment oil so this worked exactly like the pie this brand is Great. I also use their foundation and their primer and their chapstick. I really love them. It's organic skincare, non-toxic, again, glass bottles, so recyclable. And this works wonders for your skin. Again, everything that I use is really geared towards dry, sensitive skin, so if that's you, all of these are really good. Night oils. This one I think I've used up four bottles already and I just bought another one. This is a toner. It's the COQ-10 Toner Rebalance and Prime from Indie Lee. Um, Indie Lee is also another great, great, great brand. The founder, she's amazing um, and a great resource for non-toxic beauty and the entire industry. I haven't used many other products of hers, so I don't know, but I just know that I love this thing. So in the morning, instead of washing my face, I cleanse it with like a reusable cotton pad and another product that I finished here that I guess I'll show you today too. Cleanse it with a different toner that was kind of just like a rose water or rose hip water with my reusable cotton pad and then 
hydrate before I moisturize because your skin needs to be moisturized and hydrated. So right after cleansing my face, spritzed it with this toner from Indie Lee and I love it. It smells so refreshing. I also would use it sometimes um, kind of like as a setting spray for my makeup. Can't wait for the new bottle to go. This is the facial toner slash cleanser for me that I use. It's empty. I have another one. They gifted me three of them from Sky Organics. Organic Witch Hazel Facial Toner with Rose Water. This brand I recently discovered five months ago, I think, so this lasted a long time. They are an amazing brand. Everything is organic. Everything is cruelty-free, without any synthetic fragrance, made with no parabens, no phthalates, no silicones, no gluten. Two ingredients in this product, so you know that there's no Anyways, definitely recommend. The reason I don't use an actual face wash in the morning is because I already washed it at night. The only thing that I'm doing is kind of cleansing away the products that I used the night before and any sweat and like dust particles. So that's what works for me. And try it out if your skin is very dry. Skip the face wash in the morning and just use a cotton pad and a toner. That's it for today's empties with Libby. I hope this is helpful. I'm gonna link all of these products below. Bye.